Hey guys, welcome back to Calgary Barbell. This is the end of the raw week. This is our little wrap up video. A couple interesting things happened in my raw training this week, mostly with the bench press. Uh, my hips have been really, really crappy again lately. So I had a pretty bad day squatting yesterday. I worked up to my top single, took it. Hip hurt quite a bit. My lockout was all tentative and weird. As you may be able to hear in my voice, I started getting sick yesterday. So I decided it was best to just leave that. But um, I went on to do really well on my bench press, as has been the trend lately. So I worked up to 172.5 for a single. And that flew, that was probably a six and a half RP. And I decided, you know what, I didn't have a good squat, so I was gonna try and make up for it by benching 400 pounds for the first time. So I went up to 182.5, which is 402 pounds. And managed to get a press off. Uh, my spotter got pretty close to the bar, maybe touched it, so I don't know if I would count it. But uh, the strength is definitely there, and I will definitely come back for it another time. The other thing I kind of wanted to talk about was exactly what I did today, which is training sick. I got a pretty bad head cold, I'm coughing, sneezing, I'm all congested and such. Uh, so with my hips being a little bit bunged up, I decided to forego my deadlifts and my good mornings today and just bench. Uh, so I got in, I did what I could, and I spent a little bit of extra time doing some GPP style stuff, just rolling and stretching and trying to open my hips up and, and work things uh, into a little bit more flexibility, a little more stability, in hopes that maybe next week I will see a little bit more of a turnaround. The reason my hips have been bad lately is because I have not been keeping up with it. Um, I am, like everybody else, lazy sometimes. Uh, I am strapped for time sometimes. So what happened over the last couple of weeks is I skipped my split squats, I skipped my GPP, and I was rushing through my warm ups. So those are three things that I've found definitely have a big impact on how well my hip handles heavier training loads, and I have not been doing those. So it's it really comes as no surprise that my hip hasn't been doing well. Uh, I've been slacking off on that stuff, so I need to do better. I need to get better at that. Uh, and I guess this is as much a reminder for myself as for you guys, but keep up on that kind of stuff. And don't be surprised if you slack off on that stuff and things start to fall apart a little bit. All right, so it's time for everybody's favorite feature in every video, the question of the day. Uh, I got asked on the YouTubes if I'm straight edge. The answer again is no. <laughs> I suppose you might, uh, might think that by looking at me, I'm covered in tattoos. A lot of straight edge guys are scene guys and listen to heavy metal music, covered in tattoos, etc. So I may fit the mold, but I do definitely enjoy a good beer and good wine, good spirits, etc. I just don't partake in the devil's lettuce. If you like the video, like, subscribe, comment below, ask us some more questions. We need fodder for this day, the question of the day thing. So let them roll in and we'll see you guys next week. What's up guys, my name is Dylan. And for those of you who don't know, I'm the one who does all the filming and editing for Calgary Barbell. I just wanted to say thank you to all the subscribers for helping us get to 1,000 subscribers. It was a huge goal of ours. Um, never expected it to even get anywhere close to this when I started, but you know we saw that people were liking the videos, so we just continued and here we are. So hopefully we can continue to grow from here. Yeah, just just really want to say thank you to all of you.